Ah, uh, ladies and gentlemen, Gungans, Droids, Candy Bunny Conans, and all those creepy looking Plagueis people lurking in the shadows out there. Uh, we got ourselves a little bit of what I call a, a problem. Wait, what is a Galaxy Heroes unless we're having problems? Uh, this was brought to my attention yesterday. Oh, PSA for you guys going into this next week of Grand Arena. I already know this past week of Grand Arena has already been a little bit crazy with these two crazy Datacron sets, but something a little crazy, maybe too crazy, bugged out. Is this level six Datacron right here with four tanks where some tanks in the game are feeling nearly invincible, especially Galactic Legend Leia. Basically, as I'm going to show you in a moment, a viewer of the Kyber Club, Bunny Mobile, the first person that really pointed us out. I, I did some territories. I did my first week of Grand Arena. Didn't come across this, but it was brought to my attention that this is constantly triggering. Anytime a tank is falling below uh, the, the whatever 100% protection, then they're gonna recover 100% protection. Well, it's only supposed to be one time, but as we're gonna see here, in a moment, it seems to be pretty much all the time. It is not just a one-time protection recovery thing. And the reason why I bring this up is because, well, if you're gonna be in Grand Arena, especially through where you don't have a lot of people, you know what, let's target someone else. Don't target someone to Kyle Ren. I kinda just wanna show you this for all it's worth here. If you're going in 3v3 three, 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 three Grand Arena and you see this Datacron on Leia, you might want to be running the other way because this Leia seems almost invincible. First off, as you can see, we're already having a hard time dishing out damage on Leia. First off, we haven't hit the first time trigger to get this, uh, uh, to, get, to get me to protection recovery. So I'm just going to purposely kind of stall this out. Let him get me below 100% protection so we can recover. I can easily solo this uh, Supreme of Kyle Ren battle. All right, there we go. So we got our protection recovery. Now, keep in mind, it's only supposed to happen one time. The first time they lose all their ma uh, all their protection, they recover 100% max protection, and then they gain 50% max protection. So it's only gonna increase. And Kylo's having a hard time demonstrating this for me right now, but eventually, hopefully, he's gonna hit that again, make me fall below 100% health. And we are just gonna bounce right back to 100% max health. And of course, we're gonna trigger likely that 50% max health, uh, max protection increase yet again. So again, I'm purposely stalling this out, but as you can see in a 5v5 format, uh, Lei is kind of doing all right, it seems, trying to 1v5 the Super Kylo that we have in front of us here with the Special Forces Datacron, I believe here. So again, we're just gonna kind of wait, stall it out. But give it a moment, give it a moment. They're gonna eventually, I think, get me below 100% protection. And look at that, it happened again. So let me go show you the purse that brought this to my attention. Uh, there are a couple ways to perhaps handle this, but it's gonna be a couple far in between things that we're gonna see here. So first off, big thank you to Bunny Mobile, the guy who's always uh, making sure I try to get some Friday Night Grand Arenas out there. As you can see here, hey Arnold, I, ho I hope you see this. I'm about to give you some very important information going to your next 33 round. The level six data crown that I showed that recovers 100% protection after you fall below 100% health is bugged. It actually triggers every single time you fall below 100% health. I'll make a video showing it tonight, but basically makes Bane having a hard time beating Leia. I have to use the SL Care DC and ramp up to a thousand siphon to beat it. Hope this helps. And that's basically one way of handling this is hoping that a Leia is gonna be idiotic and not go for Kylo. I could have won this battle easily at this point, but we're purposely letting Kylo ramp up. Boom. We trigger the protection gain again. I want to believe that this is bugged. I mean, it says first time, but it's happening every single time. So if you're going to be going to this next grand arena here and wondering why the heck can't I kill Leia, good chance it has this data crown. Hopefully they fix it because, man, Leia already has only a couple of counters. And now because of a bug data crown, because she's a tank, yeah, she's going to be kind of nutty. But as you can see, that is something that you can maybe do is get Supreme or Kyle Ren to ramp up like crazy. But again, I gave him the opportunity to do so. And eventually, he'll just deal a big blow to Leia Argana and one shot her. Now that I'm thinking about it, what if we just did a Leia team with just a bunch of tanks? I know we did just a 1v5 a second ago. Yeah, but what if we just did this here? So it looks like this has the Retribution data crown. So again, let's just throw it on auto and we should be able to see. All right, so there we go. We got some protect recovery one time on base. Let's see if it'll happen again. All right, but as he's taunting, so he's going to take reduced damage because of that data crown. Let's see if they're gonna get it again in a second. Just let Leia do her thing on full auto. Just let her do her thing right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I just wanna see Baze get the recover again. So just to show you, this is, oh, don't, don't, don't kill, I want him yet. I don't wanna kill him yet. There we go, just let, let, don't kill Kylo yet. Don't kill him yet. There we go, Kyle's gonna go into the ultimate. I think Baze might trigger that protect recovery again. Boom! 
see what I'm saying? He got it yet again. And as you can see, we're going to have, when you have a full team of tanks that are almost unkillable, yeah, that's going to be a problem. Don't, don't kill them off yet. All right, I guess we just, <laughs> we just, oh God. So just to show you how powerful this is going to be, I'm just going to put L337, who you can't get shocked, you can't get any of that stuff, because L3 just cleansed it off, right? I just want to show you how difficult this is going to be. And imagine if this is just a full team of tanks. Uh, yeah, this could get a little nutty. So I'm just going to set it in, throw it on full auto. We're going to show that the chair is obviously a better player than the average person. So chair, it's all up to you. Throw it on auto. I will be back in five minutes. Uh, enjoy the show. You got it, chair. You're the best. You got it. Take out the papers and the trash. Or you don't get no spending cash. If you don't scrap that kitchen floor, you ain't gonna rock and roll no more. Yakety yak. Don't talk back. Yakety yak. Yakety yak. Yakety yak. Yakety yak. Yakety yak. Yakety yak. Well, what do you know? The chair is better than me. You know, we got to try it out. I keep talking about this full team of tanks that we got going on here. Let's do a full team of tanks. They have an insta kill, but I'm also going to nudge things even more annoying by getting the revive on the dark side tank allies. Yeah, that's going to be even more annoying <laughs> when you finally do kill off. They just revive again. Oops, got to start all over. But Kenobi does have a healing unity, which probably helps out. Make it work. So between that, maybe the big burst of damage. Be careful, Zol. Protects disruption could also be an issue. Let's send it in. Let the chair flex their skills. And we'll be back and see what they can do. Here we go. Insta kill. Reva's going to revive, uh -huh, as the name Reva would suggest. All right, uh, let them have fun. Let's see if Kidoi can beat this team in five minutes. They got to do a ton of healing immunities to get around this and big burst damage. So uh, we'll be back. All up to you, Chair. You got this. Take care of business. Take out the papers and the trash. Or you don't get no spending cash. If you don't scrap that kitchen floor, you ain't gonna rock and roll no more. Yakety yak. Don't talk back. Yakety yak, yakety yak. Yakety yak, yakety yak. Yakety yak, yakety yak. And there you go. So yeah, there you have it. There's your PSA. Don't say I didn't warn you. I'm if they don't fix this, I definitely expect this. The people are gonna utilize it. It's prisoner's dilemma. Literally, it's that. Someone's gonna crack, someone's gonna use it, and that's gonna just trigger other people starting to use it. So yeah, watch out, especially on Leia teams. I guess Master Luke could be a bit threatening. Dark Trooper Gideon. I'm actually surprised my Malgus got killed off there. He can't even get a healing immunity on him. I don't know how he died. And just to remind one more time why this is working, this clause right here. The first time they lose all their protection, they recover 100% protection and gain 50% max protection. And seeing that max protection gain on top of that, that 50%, it stacks up quickly, and especially when there's protection already on the stats. Yeah, watch out for full tank teams that are going to utilize this. Watch out for Leia's, Galactic Legends, anything else that utilizes tanks. If they're feeling unkillable, it's probably because of that. And that's going to wrap it up today, ladies and gentlemen. All you fantastic gun get the droids out there. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts down below. Best of luck uh, with this out in the wild here. And uh, more importantly, Capital Games, fix your game! Fix your game, fix it,